Oh, I had a little little bit of YouTube fame, and you, now you finally come back now? Uh, <laughs> what are you here for our ad revenue? Because there ain't much. <laughs> I can only hope that I can do as good as Corey's mom did. Eat it, Toledo. It's always good. <laughs> oh, that was great. <laughs> that was a really good one. Yeah! Hello, welcome okay, to a I cooking. Just watched it the other day. Really? It the Bears Bagels, yeah. man. Yeah, awesome. Man. Hello, welcome to a in kitchen cooking episode with my father, Ronald. Ely, the king. All right, what's the trick? What's the Ron Ely butcher trick? Have a beer in your left hand. Correct. Have the brats on the grill. Have Pitchers tongs. In the right hand. Tongs in the right hand. I think your shed might be bigger than my apartment. If anything ever happens, I might be living on it. <laughs> and then in true butcher fashion, storage. pork, storage. pork, pork. Yeah, they're all storage. Simply better beef. Ron Ely has been a butcher, a meat department connoisseur for 39 years. Shut up! <laughs> started right out of high school cutting no. meat. You started right out of, after you finished at Yale, you started. <laughs> it was hard. But... The funny thing is, is at this point, these guys have no idea the treat they're gonna get. This dude is about to cook you guys some food that's gonna blow your mind. Your minds. 1979. Nine. He's been cutting meat. He now works in Venice, Florida. Say hi. Hi. How are you today? He's <laughs> holding a knife. Service. Look at this counter. It looks great. Thank you. I just did it. Taking all the credit. I did do it all. <laughs> he moved away from me as far as he could get. <laughs> Dad, what are we eating? What are we making today? Today we're gonna make something that's pretty simple, but so good. Cheese stuffed bacon cheeseburgers. Oh. So I ain't never had one myself, how are they? It's like a cow got pregnant <laughs> with bacon and cheese, hey, and hey. it's just got a little bacon and cheese <laughs> yeah. baby hanging yeah. out inside the meat. I thought so. Which, how so good luck with that. There? Man, that is a visual that... <laughs> It's a mess to eat, but that's good. You ever gone out back in your farm and to see the pig won't stop riding the cow? <laughs> guys are weird. Because we are drinking in my kitchen, Corey knows how it rolls. We got Chicago handshakes. We're rocking old style. Oh, yeah. You've messed around with some old style. Oh, from Chicago, yeah. Nope, that doesn't make any wrong accent, too. <laughs> what? What uh, do you mean? I went to the Bears game. <laughs> stop, Bears. He was asking me, he goes, what is a Chicago accent? And then he just started doing like a Brooklyn Irish thing. <laughs> so my dad has never had Malort. Take that in real quick, though. How? I like your five even, years. I seriously can't even fathom it. Right. The amount that he loves Malort, it's unbelievable that he hasn't forced this down your throat. So right. You got to do this. Wormwood. I can't. I'm so excited. We're rolling I'm on excited. this liqueur aged in wormwood. Wormwood sounds as gross as it tastes. There's worms. Tastes like it. Cheers. Cheers. Oh, down the hatch. Don't chase it. Number six. Sit in it. Sit in it. Sit in it. Oh my god. What do they make that out of? <laughs> Some old socks from Kaminsky Park or something. There's a joke or something that everybody in Chicago. Jepson. That's the only the only place that you could really have a, a brand like that take off, I feel like, I is a place that has to deal with Chicago winners. Like that can only make someone who's going through physical pain mm -hmm. from cold win any sort of pleasure. This old is the style. Chicago handshake as an old style can't and a Jackson's more. Can't go wrong with the old style. Put your number six with cheese koozie on, Sean. What are you doing? Wait, we sell these? They have all this cool stuff. They got koozies, they got shirts, sunglasses. Hey, that was so, great. I didn't even uh, tell you to say yeah. that. We didn't rehearse that all morning. Keep watching. <laughs> these guys are something else, really. Burger time? Burger time, burger time? Burger time, burger time. All right, we got some nice thick cut smoked bacon. Uh, I don't know if I can say where we got it. Yeah, you can. Can we? Yeah. Uh, what was the name of the place? <laughs> <laughs> this is from Mariano. Mariano. Oh, yeah, man, yeah. they got the best. How could I forget? 400 degrees, yeah? 17 to 20. Right. It's in. <laughs> All right, Perfect. one job done. <laughs> we got it in. I'm done. <laughs> what? <laughs> you immediately in the grocery store, by the way, Wanted sweet onions. You oh. like you you said, yep, we're doing that. How come sweet onions? I would go with Vidalia if they had them, but I don't think they did because they're pretty uh, pretty tasty. We're gonna do a little onions. We're just gonna do a little bit for the uh, pan, kind of like how White Castle does it, where they put them in the pan and they saute them with a little. Oh, you're butter speaking our language. Pan, and you get that when you lay that meat in there and it sticks to it. Oh, good. Try not to cut yourself. Ow! No, I'm just kidding. <laughs> All right, so you get this chopped up nice. Now, my dad used to put onions and stuff in the meat, 
When you're, did you ever have that? Yeah. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. I mean, that's not bad either, but it's really not one of my favorites. I like sautéing them and just having the meat sit in it. Sure. It cooks instead. Sure. Instead of having chunks of onion that might not be cooked all the way or whatever. I don't know. Just your preference. Well, some good onions are just the best. I would have put gloves and a hairnet on <laughs> like we do at work. <laughs> we can do some butter in here. Light on. Light. You got gas here? Wow. Mm -hmm. Wow. I mean, this is right up there with the smell of bacon cooking and caramelizing is almost, it's like a twin, yeah, twin win orgasm. orgasm. Oh, okay, well, I'm orgasm. Can't say that. <laughs> orgasm. Do we use a different cutting board? You're not supposed to put red meat or chicken on a wood. Correct. I violated that so many oh times, God, but that's what me. they say. I only have one big giant wooden cutting board and that's, that's it, so deal with it. <laughs> That's all you're getting, world. You got one board, that's what you use. Check this out. This is lean, mean, ground chuck. There it is, look at that. Oh, there's there's like a brain. Look at that. That's the flavor spots, we call them, at work. Everybody goes, why is that meat a little dark? That's the flavor good. spot, honey. You don't have a uh, scale, do you? Uh, Corey has it for when he mails our packages. <laughs> yeah, that's true, yeah. <laughs> I was thinking a kitchen scale. <laughs> that's, a, that's what we use when we mail our packages. <laughs> Just need a few more patrons. Where are you? Yeah. There you are. Patrons. <laughs> yeah, look into the, the close angle and not the wide that Corey's holding. Oh, okay. <laughs> All right, so here's what I'm doing. Uh, <laughs> my brothers and my kids always thought it was funny that I'm making these panties. Look at this. Perfectly round, nice and thin. Right? Yeah. And when I make them and I, and I weigh them without even looking anymore, they're always the same weight. I, I love that. So the store carries plenty of pre-made patties, but that's not how Ron Ely rolls, dude. Oh, they had them, didn't they? Oh, they oh, had they so had. many of them. They had 15 different varieties over at uh, Mariano's. Mariano's. Owned by Kroger, which you worked at for what, 15 years? Uh, 10. 10 years over there. Farmer Jack before Nothing that. Cares. You guys know A and P before that. See the thing is with these burgers, it's a lot of meat. Not right. mad about it. It's got double patty basically. Or you, another way you can do it, I've seen it done, is you take it like this and you you, you go like this. Yeah, you put, you that put that's like a cheese. In that's the what they do in like Minnesota. This. That Juicy you Lucy know. is oh. like yeah. That's the Juicy Lucy. They right. do that with that. It's like a it's a ball of meat. Like it's literally not even a patty shape. I've always did it this way and. I don't know, you guys always liked it, so. Yeah, it was great. Sometimes I used to make them, I'd use the rolling pin to get them really thin for you guys. Because remember, you didn't like thick burgers. Yeah. Like uh, McDonald's had. Oh, I want them like McDonald's. Well, yeah, I was a, blame me. I, I was too. a real bitch. You're a bitch. Uh oh, press. Someone's I... not checking his elements. Oh my god. <laughs> <laughs> that might be the best part of the video. <laughs> oh my god. <laughs> no, they're good. It smells really good. Here. It does smell really good. I'm kind of sit right there. I used to think that you guys ate all this stuff, Corey. We do. <laughs> <laughs> like, when you oh. see yourself on camera 20 times a month and you go, oh, I don't look good, you start to, <laughs> yeah, you start to right. change. Something. I'm a little chunky. Corey, your face is looking fat. <laughs> all right, guess I'm, guess I'm done taking more than one bite. <laughs> Just, <laughs> almost done. Could make one for the dog. Yeah, doggy burger. So yeah, when I when I can tell you guys are really into it, and you're like, oh man, this is five, five whatever it is, five donkeys or five pigs or <laughs> pigtails or whatever you come up with. It's like I bet they eat all that. I like it like that. <laughs> so he says. We've been doing the. My dad's been here 48 hours, and we probably said the Garth Brooks. I like that. <laughs> 400 oh, times. that's the new thing. And then it when it's, it's something cool. we really like, we'll stop and go, and I really like that. <laughs> and I really like that. Because you can break down the walls. <laughs> so it's wiping the walls out between you and me. I mean, oh. the thing was disturbing. But... <laughs> that's so true. But it's funny. <laughs> Somehow. You always put a pinch of salt on your meats. I already know all the comments in this video. Well, we know where Sean got it. He just starts doing another accent for no reason. Restaurant Impossible. That's you that made me start doing that. These are gonna be like a little bit over the top because it's number six with cheese. So we're gonna add cheese. We're gonna stuff it oh. with a big chunk of cheddar. Oh yeah. Refrigerator shot in post, leave it. There it is. Boom. Is that too much cheese? This GoPro we have right here, um, I had it on video mode. It shot 1,130 photos instead. <laughs> <laughs> really? 
<laughs> GoPros will just act up for no reason. Like it'll be in video mode and it'll just start shooting photos. Makes no sense. Mine does that, but mine's like a knockoff. Uh, Sean, tell me about that. He what do you buys the, what are you, what is he he buys the $40 GoPro that's like. <laughs> What's some, it called? I don't know, like uh, Stop Pro? Or <laughs> you, you told me about that at one point. It's not, uh, what is the name of that? It's a really bizarre name, too. So, you know, one of the biggest camera companies in the world is GoPro. <laughs> this is the Apeman. Ape. <laughs> <laughs> Why would they name it that? All right. Ape, look at this, look at this thing. It's like literally the exact same concept, same top, same uh, bottom mount, but this is an, look how small the screen is. This is an Apeman. I think it probably shoots in 460p. How's the bacon looking, Corey? Oh. Oh. What are we thinking? How's it look? Drain a little bit of grease off and run it in there. Mm. I mean, it looks pretty damn good. It does look pretty good. That, who, nobody does this, what was that? It's coming around real good. Hot tamale. Okay, cool. Making the dog burger. Pretty doggy. Chop it like you would an onion there at the end. Oh God, I just cut my hand off. Yeah. All right, how's that looking? It's in the center with it. Cheese. Checking, checking my work. <laughs> Just a little, a little bit of onions. These have already been cooked off. They're ready to go. As you saw, hopefully. We got more onion sauteing. So we're going to have plenty of onion. Bacon in the burgers. Crumbled. Pre cooked. You saw it. Doesn't get any better than this. Do it. Patties. Cheese. All ready to go. Boom. 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 Is that insane? It's insane. Look at this. You can't even hardly pick it so up. So how is it going to stay together? You got to be careful. Go around you. Pinch it. You give it a pinch. Around the edge. Tuck it under a little bit. You pinch it. Pull it under. Huh? Look at this thing. I mean, it's defying what I think science really and truly is, but that's cool. <laughs> it's defying science. So look, it's sealed basically all the way around. These could be all called hot nuggets. No, they couldn't. That, no, you get that's what it's taken. And here they go. All made, loaded, full, huge on the onions. And you can also do these on the grill. Today we're doing them inside because it's like 25 degrees out. <laughs> All right, burgers on the stove. We've done this before. We'll do it again. Shot break. Oh, all right. Off camera, he called it a mallard. <laughs> Shot of Jepson's mallard. <laughs> it's bad the second time, too. Ho! Oh, does wake you up. Mm -mm. All right, we're going to turn them. Yeah. Woo! Look at that. Look at that caramelizing. Oh Get those onions on there. Onions sticking to it. Still plump. They're not leaking. Wow. A few more minutes. I'm Mick loving it. <laughs> oh. <laughs> See how new I am? <laughs> Just for fun. If you like bacon, and who doesn't? Vegans. More crispy bacon on top. Okay. Oh my God. Oh my god. Oh my god, yeah. Cheese? And, uh, cheese? Oh cheese? God. What bacon. kind of cheese? So awesome. Cheddar. Chunk cheddar. So we're just gonna put the lid on real quick. It's gonna be so funny that it looks like we did this like really quick. <laughs> somebody will try to do this at home, they're like, that didn't work at all. <laughs> I lost my job because I took too long. <laughs> I thought we were having a nice I missed burger. My shift. That's terrible. Looking good. That's a so lot good. of cheese. That's a lot of meat. Put them all on here. Put them on the bun. They fit perfectly. We got some nice bakery buns. And they're yeah. loaded with bacon, onions, and cheese. Is there anything on this that you don't like? <laughs> I don't think so. <laughs> boom, boom, boom. Three guys, three burgers. Oh, sharper knife would have been better. <laughs> wow. Oh my god, it did turn out good. I'm so happy. Wow. I'm freaking out right now. This looks amazing. <laughs> I freaked out Corey. <laughs> <laughs> my dad was very excited to meet Corey. This oh, is yeah. the first time my dad has met Corey. I've basically been adopted. So I just want everyone, I just want to, I just want everyone to know that that was a real thing. It's awesome.
three bacon stuffed cheese burgers with onions acquired. Oh <laughs> God! <laughs> Let me take my glasses off. <laughs> <laughs> Roasted. Oh, it's so great. All right, you saw all the close-ups. You saw Ron Ely doing what he does. You saw me and Corey salivating over this burger. I have not had a Ron Ely stuffed burger mm. like this in years because he's moved away and ruined my dreams. <laughs> Just kidding. Cheers. 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 Oh my god. Oh my god. <laughs> oh my god. <laughs> Mmm. Mm. This is so good. There's something about that brings me back. There's something about the cheese oozing out of two patties. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Oh, the bacon in the middle. Mmm. And what type of cheese did you use on this? We got like a block of cheddar. Shark like, cheddar. Yeah. We were talking about it in the grocery store. Mm. Sometimes when you use like thinner slices, it just kind of oozes out and it's liquidy. Yeah, kind of that makes it liquid. thick. And the flavor of that. Yeah, it doesn't leak out. Look at it. Oh my god, that is stupid good. I'm gonna do a shout out to John. At Win Dixie. John, American hero. By the way, Ron's coming back to Florida with some goodies. Hope you're ready for Christmas, buddy. Actually, I was thinking about not coming back. <laughs> <laughs> well, I guess I will. We might go mail them to you. <laughs> this is too good. Mm. 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 Dude, Here I can't wait to make these for my friends and blow their minds and give no credit to Mr. Ely. I'm gonna, <laughs> yeah, yeah, oh I'm yeah. I'm gonna soak all that credit, credit up. Corey, <laughs> where'd you learn how to do this? It's something about that oozy gooey oozy gooeyness that comes out of there. The bacon on top, the bacon in the middle. We got soft potato buns that we put in the oven for a couple minutes, like to get them nice and crispy. Always crisp your buns, dude. Don't yeah, have a seriously. cold bun with a hot burger, right? Oh, yeah. I'm standing move, on the counter. That yeah. move to put the onions on the inside, too. Oh, yeah. yeah. I'm tasting that. That caramelized, yeah, that caramelized sauteed onion. onion action going on. Double bacon. You got double bacon. <laughs> uh oh, here comes a beast. Sit. We made a doggy burger. All right, the other Ely's here. Sit. Ready? Here, right here. Make it, make it, make it. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> lick a lip, lick a lip. Yeah, baby, I just wanna see you dip, see you dip. Shout out to Eric Healy too. So, so brother, he should be here. The real yeah. deal. So the reason this episode happened, my brother Eric, my only other sibling, had the idea that if we're gonna do a cooking video with Dad, it had to be these burgers. Oh yeah. And I don't know if I would have thought of it. Honestly, I don't know. So Eric, shout out to you. Dad, thank you so much to you for uh, coming to Chicago for mm. visiting. Thank you for taking time out of your vacation to be in a video. More than glad to do it. Happy, having a great time in Chicago. Anybody that's watching this, if you're not in Chicago, you should come. Mm. Hey man, we couldn't be Good bigger time. homers for this place, so I, I agree. How do you feel about uh, Malort? If you're smart, don't drink that. <laughs> <laughs> Malort, you could do better. Jepson's Malort. Have some self-respect. <laughs> Number six. I'll see you guys tomorrow for a brand new video. Thank you so much for watching. Before they cruise out, are you guys gonna get any? F oh my God. You created a monster. Nobody wants to see Marsha no more. They want Sean. Ron's chop oh. At the end of this video, show a little montage of how I've taken Ron around Chicago. Giordano's. Now that's how it's supposed to be. Oh. <laughs> oh, Cheval. So good. Loyalist. Green Street Smoked Meats. I don't even know how I'm gonna be able to talk and, and describe it. <laughs> Thank you guys so much for watching. Corey, thanks for being the best Dan co-host I could ever have Bye. to show my dad this city. Thank you. All right, Chicago Stall Dog, cheers. Cheers. This view is amazing. This is the spot. <laughs>